What's up, everyone? Happy Wednesday. We got another sunny day here. We're back at Jones Beach, over here by the theater, by Zach's Bay. Pretty evening. Um, busy day today, running around doing a bunch of stuff, and a couple of uh, Zoom calls today, and tagged a bunch of my friends here that were on our uh, syndicate. Every Wednesday, we have a three o'clock call with a bunch of uh, doers and friends and we support each other we kick each other in the ass and um try and make each other's lives better and uh so a little shout out to everyone there it's great to have you be on a call with you guys and get inspired and get a kick in the ass and i don't know i just kind of need that get out of the funk um wiley was back on haven't seen wiley in a while uh it's good to see wiley um good stuff all around so I get you the message of the day, and I was thinking about it, and um, yesterday I rode this bike, and the ride was a little tough. I don't know, I thought I was just tired, didn't really know what was going on. And today, when I went to take the bike off the truck, I grabbed the back tire, and the tire was a little low. So it had like 20 pounds in it, I filled it up to like 50 pounds, and I rode today, and it was so much easier. And kind of parallels to a thought I had is that are you settling for less than is out there, less than God has in store for you? Yesterday I settled for a tire with 20 pounds of air in it and it made my ride rather difficult. I won't say rather difficult, but uh, if you ever tried it, ride a bike with 20 pounds of air in a tire and ride a bike with 50 pounds of air in a tire. Big difference, same bike, same location, same ride, same 10 miles. Yesterday was a lot harder than today. So I got on a call today, uh, three o'clock call. And I think, uh, I think in a way, maybe I'm settling for less than God has in store for me. And I think that's common of a lot of people. Life gets hard, things get hard. We wind up getting stuck and settling, settling for good enough, settling for okay, Settling for less than than is in our future, less than God has in store for us. And we need to realize that. And uh, thank you to my friends out there that give me a kick in the ass every Wednesday. Um, need to try harder. Need to do more. Um, need to expect more. Um, Wiley was giving me shit about... Um, I need to manifest it. I need to know exactly what I want and I need to go manifest it because you find what you focus on and I've been focusing on crap lately, um, focusing on lack when I need to focus on abundance. And I think it's true for a lot of us. We need to focus on abundance. We need to focus on what is out there for us. We need to know what's out there and go get it like a buried treasure. Uh, sitting here at the beach, I'm sure there's some treasures, treasures buried out there. And I bet you, uh, if you went and dug hard enough, you'd probably find uh, the treasure. So, we need to stop focusing on what we don't have. We need to start focusing on what we're about to have, what we need, what we want, what we're going to get. Uh, there is no tries in life. There's do or don't. There's no try. Thank you, Wiley, for that. Um, constant reminder. Um, so we need to literally decide what we want and go get it. Simple as that. We need to stop riding with a tire that's flat. We need to fill up our tires. We need to surround ourselves with people that are gonna help us get to the finish line. And we need to go get what we want. No more riding with a flat tire. No more settling for less than God has in store for us. All right, so there's your message of the day. Hope that inspires you a little bit, inspired me a little bit today to go out and uh, get some stuff done. All right, let's jump on prayers. The sun is beautiful today. In the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to not settle for less than you have in store for us. Help us to not get used to riding with a flat tire. Help us to fill the tires up and get on our rides. Help us to 
surround ourselves with positive thinking people help us to stop trying and stop talking about trying and start doing there is no try it's do or don't help us to realize that we, that we are a lot better than we think we are and we have a lot more in us than we think we have um, to manifest uh, what you have in store for us and for us to have the confidence and the faith to go get it amen all right everyone happy wednesday once again get out and enjoy a beautiful evening sunshine water it's good for the soul um more of the weekends coming up this ride is almost over uh what am i at? six days left now uh which that brings me i think uh i think in more of days the last ride i gotta do the math um 365 days in a row riding 10 miles a day giving you guys messages and uh it's been a long journey it's been pretty awesome some days good some days tough in the rain and snow uh Lots of great feedback from everyone. Uh, I love all the messages, everyone reaching out, the inspiration, the encouragement. Um, you can do anything you want if you set your mind to it. I just rode just about 365 days in a row, 10 plus miles on my bike, rain, snow, sleet, uh, Dallas, Florida, um, hotel bikes, you name it, 10 miles plus a day for 365 days in a row, non-negotiable. You can do anything you want, decide what you want, go get it. All right, everyone, put your head on a pillow every night knowing you're making the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go.